Scientology, Leah Rimini calls Tom Cruise's religion an abusive organization. Leah Rimini is not one to back down from exposing the truth about Scientology behind its promises. While members call it a body of religious beliefs and practices, the Kevin Can Wait actress calls it an abusive organization. She then starred in a critical docker series, Leah Rimini, Scientology and the Aftermath, to back up her claims. The 47-year-old actress was a proud loyalist of Scientology since she was just nine years old. Leah Rimini had been promoting and defending the controversial church because she truly believed in its promises. However, she shockingly left Scientology in 2013 after realizing that it is far from what it was claiming, which is to make the world a better place. Leah Rimini then teamed up with former senior executive of the Church of Scientology International, CC, and the C organization based in the United States, Mike Rinder, to expose what it's really like being a member of Scientology in her docker series, Leah Rimini, Scientology and the Aftermath. Both of them, plus their ex-Scientologist guests, repeatedly noted that the institution that was developed in 1954 by American author L. Ron Hubbard is a dangerous place, revealing that members are being abused and families are being torn apart. Multiple guests on the Leah Rimini, Scientology and the Aftermath series have expressed their anger towards Scientology. They shared that even though they have finally gotten their freedom back after leaving the organization, they are still heartbroken because they were parted from their loved ones because of the inhumane rule of disconnection. Members who have decided to leave Scientology are considered as a suppressive person or SP. Therefore, their families who are still in the controversial church are expected to disconnect from them completely. This is the main reason why some Scientologists who wanted to leave Scientology still decided to stay because they want to keep their families intact. Leah Rimini also revealed that Scientology is all about intimidation. In fact, many believe that the cult-like religion is behind the cause of boycotting Kevin Can Wait on social media. The said protest started when anti Scientology activist Leah Rimini became a part of the CBS comedy following Erin Hayes' departure. The timing is just too coincidental for people to not think that the organization had something to do about it.